In 2010, there were over 2 billion internet users and this number doubled in 2022 with over 5.07 billion internet users currently. According to the US Bureau of Labor Statistics, the employment of web developers is projected to grow by 8% from 2019 to 2029, much faster than the average for all occupations. This data demonstrates the unstoppable demand of web developers worldwide in the current IT industry. Many people are motivated to concentrate and become experts in web programming languages that can help them land their ideal career because of the sheer demand of web developers across the world. Yet, only some know how to rule the field and secure a position with the tech giants. Now, that's the topic for discussion today. Hello everyone and you are already watching Simply Learn. Here we are with the complete roadmap to become a web developer in 2023. Before we start, if you guys enjoy watching these videos and if you are new to our channel, then consider getting subscribed to our channel to get daily updates on latest technological trends and press the bell icon to never miss any updates from SimpleLearn. So, what is web development? Web development is a branch of computer science that deals with creating and maintaining a website or a web application. Every website you come across is a mix of certain methodologies. A website is generally divided into three parts, front-end, the section that is visible to everyone. Backend, the website section is not accessible to the user. Database, where all the data of the website is stored. A web developer not only creates the website, but also ensures that the website should not face any issues right after the deployment. Before moving on to the job profiles, it's important to understand the different fields of web development. Web development is further divided into three parts front end web development, back end web development, and full stack web development. Front end web development. Front end development is the branch of web development that concentrates on user experience. The main motive of the front end is to ensure that the data is presented in an understandable and visually appealing manner. Without front end development, you would see incomprehensible codes on a website or web application. But thanks to front end developers, non programmers can easily use and comprehend websites and web applications. So, how to become a front end developer? And what technologies do you need to master to call yourself a full fledged front end web developer? The first step to becoming a front end developer is to find yourself a technology that is easy to understand. Many technologies are present in the area, but which one should you choose? HTML creates the structure of a web page. It shows how the content should be placed on a web page. CSS is used to style the web page because it's important to make it look more appealing to the user. JavaScript furthermore adds interactivity to any web page. It can help you create a dynamically active web page by adding elements to engage the user. One should learn JavaScript for logic building as well. Generally, these three technologies, HTML, CSS and JavaScript are enough to create the basic front end of any web page. You can work on projects like creating a calculator app, an e-commerce website, or even a Wordle game using JavaScript. You can take reference from the videos mentioned in the description box below. Create one of your own. Bootstrap is another front-end technology that is not necessary to learn, but always adds to your skills. A framework based on CSS and JavaScript that is used to make a web page more interactive and mobile-friendly as well. JavaScript frameworks like React, Angular, Vue, and jQuery are also used for front-end web development. It depends on the learner if they want to pick one or all of the frameworks. I would suggest you to go for React as it is the most widely used JavaScript framework. However, some professional developers prefer Vue.js because of its ease of use. Now, these are all the technologies you need to master for front-end web development. But possessing the knowledge of any additional website deployment tool can act as the cherry on top while applying for a job. Netlify and Versal are free deployment tools to take your application online. It is rightly said that you can master a language only by programming it. So, projects also play a vital role while you go through the learning process. You can create Facebook or a YouTube clone with the help of React.js. The link mentioned in the description box below for the same. So, this is what the proper roadmap for front-end development looks like. What about the salary of a front-end web developer? 
According to Glassdoor, the salary of a front-end developer in the United States ranges between $50,000 to $100,000 with an average salary of $76,000 per annum with additional benefits. Next comes back-end web development. Backend development, the backbone of web architecture, is the term used to describe tasks carried out while executing programs on the web. Backend development handles the server-side functionalities and activities like designing APIs, creating libraries, and working with system components. Since the backend makes an API call and the server-side rendering is handled entirely by the backend functions designed to perform specific tasks, the skills required in backend web development differ from what we came across in frontend. The first step to entering the backend is understanding the concept of web servers. Web server manages websites and responds to user requests by storing, processing, and delivering online pages. When a web server receives a request from a user, an HTTP server accepts it and finds and returns the requested material to the browser using HTTP. Open source platforms that distribute content in response to queries include web servers like Apache and NGINX. The next step in backend web development requires knowledge of programming languages. Additionally, frameworks are collections of libraries that simplify and facilitate programming. Although many programming languages are available, only a few are frequently advised for backend web development. Node.js is a JavaScript framework used for backend API services. The power provided by Node.js and the beauty of JavaScript can be used together to create the backend of a web page. Python and Django Python is the most user-friendly programming language, and when combined with Django, it makes a fantastic website building tool. PHP with Laravel PHP is a quick, adaptable, and practical language that runs the most well-known websites and blogs. Laravel and PHP can work on the backend of a web page as well. Now, it depends on you to choose the technology set out of these technologies. To get data from a database, a backend developer writes code that does the relational mapping. MySQL, SQL Server, PostgreSQL, MongoDB, and Oracle Database are the most popular database management systems. You must be quite familiar with how they operate. Using a version control system is the best practice because it allows you to alter the source code whenever you want rapidly. Git, a free and open source version control system, may be the ideal option due to its secure, adaptable, and simple to edit characteristics. Two apps can communicate with one another thanks to APIs, which serve as software mediators. Backend developers utilize APIs to connect services or applications and start conversations to enhance user experience. You should be familiar with some APIs like REST, JSON, SOAP, and JSON. The list goes on, but you can start with any one of your choice. Everything including software, applications, services, and products is moving towards cloud services. A backend developer should know what clouds are and how to use them. Mostly used cloud services are Google Cloud, Amazon Web Services, and Microsoft Azure. So you can pick one of these cloud services and then you'll be ready to become a backend developer. You can practice for projects particularly related to any language like PHP. You can also learn how Python and Django are used for web development. Refer to the videos mentioned in the description box below. These videos are specifically designed to make you guys understand the basics of backend web development. So, what salary can you expect after learning backend web development? According to Glassdoor, the salary of a backend developer in the United States ranges between $46,000 to $100,000 with an average salary of $80,000 per annum, with additional benefits. A little about front-end development? Of course, the learning path for back-end developers is slightly harder than the front-end. Now, coming to full-stack web development. They are individuals capable of developing a website's front-end and back-end. Full-stack technology refers to the total depth of a web application. There is no special technology related to full-stack development. A full-stack developer should know about every technology. There is no shortcut for this. You should know technologies like HTML, CSS, JavaScript, followed by any framework, and backend technologies like Node.js, PHP, and many more. Additionally, a full-stack web developer should know databases, APIs, and almost everything. They have the expertise to handle any task, including customer interaction, system engineering, database management, server administration, and architecture. 
you cannot follow a specific roadmap to become a full stack developer. If you are done with both front end and back end, congrats, you are good enough to call yourself a full stack web developer. Reports from Glassdoor.com have shown that a full stack developer in the United States earns between $50,000 to $125,000 per annum with additional cash benefits. The salary of a full stack developer makes you apply for a job, but the learning curve is also steep. Everyone could master the programming languages we discussed for different job roles today, but the real deal is to implement your learnings. As you enter an interview, picture yourself stating, I have a respectable portfolio of projects. I learned about the company's future endeavors, which align with my goals. Now, who could possibly reject that, right? In particular, businesses that want to think creatively and break convention to create something remarkable will never say no to such candidates. Web development is a vast field, and the future looks promising now more than ever. So, if you are looking to upskill yourself and I know that you are, check out Simply Learn's Full Stack Job Guarantee Program. The Full Stack Java Developer Program is an intense bootcamp offering a complete suit of software development skills. Enroll now and get an assured job on course completion. Well, that's a wrap for this video and I hope the video was informative. Thanks for watching, subscribe to our channel and stay tuned for more from Simply Learn. Hi there, if you like this video, subscribe to the Simply Learn YouTube channel and click here to watch similar videos. To nerd up and get certified, click here.